I just wanted to have a, a quick word about merch. Now, when you're doing your gig, obviously, um, don't talk about the merch during the gig until really right at the end. That's what I would suggest. The um, just before you do the last song, say, try this. This is going to be my last song, but after after I've finished, about five minutes after. There's a table down at the back with all sorts of goodies, CDs and T-shirts and things like that. So I'm going to be down there to sign anything that you've got. So if you want to bring me anything, um, any CDs of mine or any T-shirts or any posters or anything like that that you'd like me to sign, that's where I'm going to be. So hopefully I'll see you down there in about five minutes. Because if you say, oh, I've got things to sell and merch, Merch is, is fine as a word within the music industry, but outside of it, it sounds a little bit cold and clinical in my particular, in my personal opinion. So, um, you know, refer to them as goodies, exciting things, all sorts of interesting stuff, rather than merch. Merch is just bleh. And the way to get people down there, of course, is for you to give them something value added. They can buy your CDs from the website or download your tunes from iTunes or whatever. The whole thing about going to uh, going to a gig and meeting the artist is getting something, getting a bit of value add, getting something that's that's actually a bit special, a bit one-off, you know. Uh, so just try it. This is our last song, and um, after this, about five minutes after we finish, uh, there's a table down at the back there and uh, I'll see you down there if you've got anything you'd like me to sign. Just a thought. Thank you.